Ohana. Teaching the kids Hawaiian dance. How cute is that? And now everyone that's celebrating his birthday this month gets to get on the stage and learn to dance the Hawaiian dance. going to sing a song in honor of everyone that's celebrating their anniversary this month. Song and a dance. Yeah. 
inviting the lovers to come forth, forward and do a slow dance with them. Guys, again, again and again and again and again, the chicken is delicious. Chicken is really amazing. It's just too good. So guys, just, just to be clear, the singing and the dancing does not go on until the end of the dinner. So they have break. And they will be coming back, they said, but we don't know when or for how long but it's still worth it. I'm loving this dinner, really. Loving everything about it. Yeah? Yeah. She has it all in her life. She can really eat. I thought she would do this. And she looks so boos. She's going to look so boos. Guys, for dessert, we're going to get pineapple guava cake and chocolate cake. Can't wait to see what it is and how it's presented. Man, I can't get over how delicious that chicken was. <laughs> On about to see, we request that children remain seated for the entire performance. We ask your cooperation. They're requesting people to remain seated. This is probably where the fire dancers will come out. I love the Hawaiian culture. I just love culture. All kind of culture, actually. I love it. I love when people are proud to show off the culture, no matter what it is. It doesn't have to be fancy, as long as it's authentic. And I mean that. Me and Mike love, love this kind of stuff. So if you guys, anything like us, you will enjoy this. Boys and girls, thank you for joining us for Disney's Spirit of Aloha Dinner Show. At this time, we ask that you please refrain from using any additional video camera lighting for the comfort of our performers and other dining guests. We hope you enjoy the show, and mahalo. Mahalo. This is the last call. So they give you a warning, a clear indication that if you wanna, if you wanna order anything, because it's all you can eat. If you wanna order anything, this is your last chance. Because hereafter, they're gonna do one more sitting. Seating, is that what you call it? Oh, there it is. Oh, it looks good. 
Looks really good. Thank you. Yum. Looks delicious. So yeah, so they tell you when the last round is and you get to do your last order, whatever that is. When you're done, you're done, then you get the dessert. Let's cut it in two.
everyone got a lay, right? Yes. Did you also get a kiss? No kiss. Oh my goodness, that's a very old Hawaiian tradition. So I want everyone, and that means everyone, yeah, to turn to the person to your right or your no. left or the kinky on your lap and give them a big friendly kiss on the cheek. Go on, yeah. Like 100 leaves from the tea plant can make one skirt for each mahine. And for this hula, natural instruments are used like this hollowed out gourd called the ipu. A pair of split bamboo reeds called puili. And these rattling gourds covered with feathers from tropical birds called uliuli. Using these instruments, we will tell the story of the four islands surrounding the channels that guide travelers to the islands of Polynesia. And now, we enjoy Namoku Eha.
painting of the Ibu, and instead of singing, chanting was used to tell the stories of the world around us. These stories are sacred to us. Here to tell you the story of Pele, the volcano goddess, are the Kane, with a hula kahiko. Giving you the and culture of all the Hawaiian the islands. Then you will meet the, head, the handsome Kane who performed the Samoan slap dance. They are joined by the women of the village, including the Tonko, the chief's daughter. When she arrives, all the men will compete with each other for her attention in dance. We call it the Fa'atau Pati, the Samoan slap dance, and the Samoan Sasa. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, thank you. Help me. <laughs> Aloha. Aloha. Sabota lofa. Sabota lofa. You guys gonna have some fun? Yeah. All right, in Samoa we like to do a little warm up before we start to dance. You guys wanna try it? All right, do as I say and follow me. When I say me, me means to run. So everybody, me in your hands. Watch the beast and cut one time. Watch ya! Watch ya! Watch ya! Me! Watch ya! Blue What happened? What happened? Blue Abati! Watch ya! Blue Abati! Watch ya! Watch ya! Watch ya! Watch ya! Everybody clap two times and you yell out, oh, Ruba's for oh, oh, the arm off, oh, 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 yeah, oh, Ruba's for oh, 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 o
mind when I say, hey, hey, do say, oh,
It's inspiring. It's mo'olelo, tradition. Speaking of tradition, hula is an integral part of our culture. It is the language of our hearts, and therefore the heartbeat of our people. Here to sing a beautiful song about our home, Miss Kima, and the lovely Lenormino dancing.
This dance is about a Tongan family paddling their canoes all over the world, and everywhere they go, they are greeted warmly and share in a ceremonial drink of kava. I can't wait to see it. Let's hear for Tonga! La 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 la! La 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 Oh, 
these girls are so good.
That guy was amazing. It was amazing. I've never seen anything really like this. Do that so well with fire dancing. <laughs> oh, thank you everyone for joining us this evening. It is wonderful sharing the spirit of Aloha with all of you. Yeah, this has been my best luau Beautiful. It's really amazing. Do this show. It's really awesome. It's worth every penny. Oh my god, I can't stand up. The chairs are too low. My legs and back. <laughs> Oh my god, oh my god, oh, I'm up you guys. Mike, you need a hand? <laughs> what? You need a hand. I had troubles getting up. The chairs are really, really low. That was fun. That was awesome you guys, I really, really enjoyed that. I enjoyed that so, 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 so very much. Wow. What a carousel of culture. You got a taste of the complete Polynesian world. And I love every bit of it. Love it. What? All right, thank you for being here with us. Thank you for watching, you guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, you guys, that was amazing. Yeah, true. If it's windy, they can close these panels. It was amazing. It was so worth the money. And to be honest, I don't remember how much we paid for it. I don't know either. I think about $180? For the two of us, yeah, something like that. It's worth every penny. It really is the vibe, what you see on stage. And if you like the Polynesian world, they're showing you a bit of the culture of all the Polynesian islands, even New Zealand. It's just amazing, you guys, just beautiful. It really is beautiful.
you feel like you were, I know this is very corny but you feel like I was just saying telling Mike the whole time you feel like you're uh, on a family uh, wedding party or something like that what is the smoking area? Oh, so they closed it off. I think they closed. So can't smoke. I don't know. Maybe the other side? No, there's no other side. Is that supposed to be like... I don't know what that is. I don't know what that's supposed to do. But I see people down there. Yes, I see people down there. You can just take the other side. Yeah, I think so. There are people sitting down there. It won't, it, won't, it won't make sense if it would just close one side. These people work really hard. Now they get it. They have to get everything ready for the next group. They do two groups. We do two groups on an evening. So we started at five, it's now seven, seven fifteen, so it's two hours. It's a total of two hours. Wow, look at the contemporary. Look, you can even see Magic Kingdom from here. The castle, but I don't think I have enough zoom. Oh yeah, there it is. That's the magic, uh, magic kingdom. Yeah, that's the castle, the heart of it. And there is the contemporary hotel, you guys. Temporary resort. And there's the Polynesian resort. We met this wonderful family. This wonderful family. They're really awesome. And the guy was vape is vaping like Mike. So we were having a little debate on the fake news that was getting uh, spread around about how it's dangerous, supposed to kill you. While well, there is a little nuance. It's not the vaping that kills you, but it's the cheap stuff people get from dealers from the street that kills you and it goes for everything so um it was really really nice to hear some someone oh look i think somebody got married here it was really nice to hear some other opinions some people that really thought about it and have di uh, did the research but yeah such a wonderful wonderful couple they were so funny Alas, they were not sitting next to us. We were sitting in between two families that did not felt like they wanted to make any kind of connection. Not even with each other. Not even with each other. <laughs> they were really cranky. Both families on both sides. And we were in the middle. But uh, just like always, you guys, the wonderful people are always a little bit further away. <laughs> because this wonderful couple that I'm just telling you about while the, the, we were taking uh, pictures at the end of the dinner show, the dancers were gone and everything, and the stage was, you know, turned off. So we went up there just like everyone else to take pictures. And out of nothing, they came out to take pictures of us. Yeah, out of nowhere. That was just amazing. Wonderful people. It means so much. I don't know, I just take that to heart. Is that how I say it when I meet such wonderful people? I'm always so touched by the kindness of others. All right. I don't know what else to tell you guys. I emptied my heart, my soul. That's it. I'm done. Go to sleep, you guys. Enough watching for today. Go to sleep. See you guys tomorrow. We love you so much. Aloha. You're our Ohana. Our YouTube Ohana. Alright, you guys. I enjoyed myself. Let me tell you one thing about the chicken. 
That chicken was delicious. The food was yeah. delicious. The show was delicious. The, the show was amazing. The show was, li the show was delicious. <laughs> Everyone was delicious. Was <laughs> but yeah, I enjoyed it. It yeah, really it had a huge impact. I just, I enjoyed it so much. Yeah. Not everybody enjoyed it, but... Well, yeah, we did, we did, we certainly did, yeah. Okay, I want to take one last picture of this Aloha thing. Look at this sign, you guys, love it. Me and Mike just took some wonderful pictures in front of it. All right. Here it is. All right, now we're really done. I know, but now we're really done. Go to sleep, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Love you. Bye bye. bye. Aloha. <laughs> I love the fire. Yeah. Oh, one final. All right, one final. One final little piece of footage for you guys because I don't want to deprive you from this. We love you too much to deprive you from any thing we love because we love to share what we love. Yeah, I was just saying, I was just saying back there. Yeah, it's beautiful. Wow, look at that smoke. People are eating up there. I hear Hawaiian chanting. Can you guys hear that? It's buzzing. It's really buzzing around here. I don't know for some reason I didn't expect it. It's, that is so buzzing. So much life going on here. There's a buzz. A buzz going on. Yeah, it's really full. Fireworks. People are saying if you stand here you can see the fireworks. Alright. We're gonna cut through this building. Get to the entrance exit get an uber oh i get it it's these guys that left all those rose petals i think we missed something it's almost valentine's day you guys so now we know what the significance of this petal is in the Polynesian culture because it was just explained to us during that dinner show no you want a pineapple float you can get one if you want no all of a sudden I don't have two anymore it's crazy. It's crazy. We need to take a picture. Oh, there's that photographer again. Perfect. We need to take to have a picture of us taken. No, you don't want to? Maybe you can wait for me. I do want a picture in front of that. If there isn't a line. There is? 